much. I am a Christian. Um, I'll be happier if we will build a national cathedral for Muslims. Another one, mm -hmm. financed by the government. Land provided by the government, $25 million provided by the government, 25 million cities provided by the government, and set up a secretariat for that. I'll be happier if the government will finance a national cathedral for traditional religion in this country. I think there's a problem with separation of church and state mm -hmm. that we don't even want to tackle it. Um, it's not the business of government to build national cathedrals. So as a Christian, no, I, don't, I don't think government is built. Government has said it's partnering the churches. Yes, the government is using state money, state seed money. property, mm -hmm. seed money, whatever you call it. It's still state money. Mm. This is where the cross of the matter is. You said you're going to build a cathedral to honor God for making you who you have become. That shouldn't be the concern of Ghanaians. That should be the concern of the presidency. I'm not sure the president said so in, in, in the exact same ways you put it. Well, I mean. I'm summarizing what he said. <laughs> so so I, I get bothered when religion becomes part of state business. It shouldn't be. Mm. It's a private enterprise. It's a private faith that people exercise. So as a Christian, I, I don't even see the value of it. I go to ICGC. The ICGC has beautiful bu buildings. Mm -hmm. And I don't see the point of creating another edifice to honor God. Mm. When a in many one. a national one, mm -hmm. in many places, when some of these edifices are actually being turned into nightclubs mm. and, and and hotels, so I, I have a, a bit concern when you 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 just oppose that against the problems of this country, even if the decision was made in 2017. Mm. We didn't have COVID then. Mm. So that the, the stresses, the extra st stresses on our economy were not there. So maybe at that time it was okay. Mm. People probably would not have paid so much attention to it mm. as they are doing now. But here we are. Very, very soon we're going to put about 450,000 new graduates into the system. There are no jobs. There are no factories. Mm. If the president was going to take $25 million to support industry, manufacturing basis in this country, I'll be very happy.